Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to go about blocking websites in the Google Chrome web browser. So while this may not block certain websites from all browsers on the computer, and you can still disable and delete extensions, if you just basically have a young uh, computer user and pretty much having just Google Chrome as the primary browser on the computer. That's basically what this tutorial is for. I mean, basically anyone can get around any sort of browser restrictions if you know how to search on Google. But this is just a general utility here. It's pretty straightforward. Basically, it's just an extension for Google Chrome that's on the web store. So it should be a pretty straightforward process, guys. Let's go ahead and jump right into it. So first thing you want to do is go ahead and actually open up Google Chrome here. And now you want to go up to the top menu bar top right corner and left click on it and you want to go down and select more tools and then you want to select extensions select the hamburger icon on the left side and then go down and select where it says open chrome web store now that you're in the web store here go ahead and search for block site and one of the best matches should say block site block websites and stay focused go ahead and open that up you see there's over a million users currently with this app, as well as it is featured in, in the web store. This is follows recommended practices for Chrome extensions. Go ahead and select Add to Chrome. And select Add Extension. Now that it's added here, you can go make a couple of adjustments. So go select I Accept. Select the Skip button. They do offer a premium version, but we don't need that for today's tutorial here. So we're just going to go ahead and click on Skip. So now at this point, go ahead and if we just close out the instructions here, to go ahead and insert a web address you want to block. So we could just do facebook.com. And then you would select the plus add item right there. So at this point, the website is just blocked. You can add up to three sites with the free version. Otherwise, you'd have to pay for a premium version here. So pretty straightforward. If you want any password protection here, you would have to have a premium version to actually set up a password. But if you just have a small child or a guest user, they probably wouldn't know. So basically, we just closed out of everything. We reopened the Chrome here. And we went to Facebook. You would see that the website is blocked. And there's really no easy way to get around that directly on this page here, unless you go up to the top right and then you select Edit Block List. But generally speaking, unless they know where to look, they're not going to you know, put that together, two and two together. So it's usually good enough for most people here, I would say. So, pretty straightforward process, guys. I do hope I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.